Hey, it's Tyskark11 for another Ultra Sun Moon Wi Fi battle using my Hero Academia team again. I'm really loving this team, which is why I've been using it a bit more than my other teams typically got used in a row. And with battles I haven't posted, I've probably used this more than anything else. So this was against someone. Random on Discord, I think. So based on what their team had, I let off with Bakugo to get some heavy hits on whatever we're going to be the lead. And that completely ruined my beginning. Unless it was Sash, which I don't think people run too much anymore. I haven't seen Sash in a long time at least. Then I probably could have just destroyed that Mammoth Swan. So I figured they would be switching out, which is why I didn't go for a fighting type move. And that Ice Shark does nothing, even as a grit. And I'm back to full HP and get Beast Boost. So this thing outspeeds and it's easily going to one shot with a hurricane or arrow slash. So have to sacrifice that plus one. So Toxic isn't too important, I can just bust right through this Chansey. And anything they're going to send in doesn't want to take too much of a hit, except for the Tornadus. They stay in maybe because they assumed I was banded, and that I wouldn't be going for a fighting type move because it was most likely superpower since Buzzswole usually runs superpower. So my only guess is they assumed I was banded and I wasn't going to use superpower because I didn't want to be locked into it after getting the drop and that their chance he could have lived the one. But since I was fighting MZ, that means I get to completely plow through the chancey. I don't think Superpower actually would have killed. Maybe it could have killed from that range, but not quite sure. Either way, the Z move is a much better option since I don't get the minus one defense and attack. So All Might has done really all he needs to at this point. But, just going to send in Kaminari to tank the Tornadus, and can use All Might as fodder later.
So this Sable Eye literally can't touch me since I'm Magic Guard. The knockoff is going to hurt a bit damage reduction, but it doesn't matter too much since I'm still going to be able to destroy this Sable Eye with a Moon Blast. Now, since Sculfable usually runs unaware, they probably didn't notice that the Life Orb meant I was running a Magic Guard set. Would've been nice to get a Flamethrower prediction here, but it didn't really matter. Pretty sure that would've KO'd even without the crit. Since I'm at plus two special defense, this thing isn't going to hurt Uraraka too much. Just hit through confusion. and snap out confusion after just one turn. So this is just them acting out of desperation. There's nothing they really can do at this point, so I don't know why they even bother going for Substitute. And then they forfeited, so I'm not sure why they even bothered going for Substitute twice there instead of just attacking. But if you want to battle me, then tweet at me asking for a battle, or contact me on Discord. There's a link to my competitive Pokemon Discord server in the description, and link to my Twitter in the description. So, see you next time!